Hello there! Here I am again and today I have something very special for you. We're going to prepare an omelette. Why an omelette? Because omelettes are very typical of an American breakfast, right? So, let's go for the ingredients first. Of course, to prepare an omelette you need eggs. This is the most important ingredient, okay? And of course, we have some salt. And um, I like onions very much, okay? And um, tomatoes. And some cheese. These are my basic ingredients for an omelette, okay? And my son really appreciates this kind of omelette. So this is my basic recipe and this is the one I'm going to be preparing today. But first of all, I'm going to wear an apron. Okay, so here's the apron. It's always good to protect your clothes. The ingredients here, we have um, a few to beat the eggs and we have a silicon spatula, okay? This is a non-sticky silicon spatula. So this is the best, um, this is most the most appropriate um, to use with uh, a non-sticky frying pan, okay? So this is, this is a non-sticky frying pan. I have my pan here. I have already added some uh, olive oil. Of course, you can also use uh, some uh, butter if you prefer butter, okay? I like to mix both, a little bit of butter and a little bit of uh, olive oil, but I have already added uh, some butter and some olive oil to my frying pan. Okay, so let's break the eggs. I usually prepare the omelette with uh, two or three eggs. It depends how hungry you are. You can use a fork to gently beat the eggs, a fork, or you can use a few. I like to use a few. Okay, so if you could zoom here, gently, gently beat your eggs. I like to use a few, but you can, you can do it with um, a fork, okay? Very good. So now, let's turn on. Not so high. Let's lower it a little bit. Oh, I forgot something. I, I, I think I mentioned the salt, right? I didn't mention the salt, so I forgot to mention the salt. Of course, the salt is also very important. I put just a little bit. I like to use this um, pink Himalayan salt, and um, it's a little bit stronger than the regular salt that uh, we usually buy in the supermarket, so you have to be careful if you use this because it's stronger. Okay, so my pan, my frying pan is already hot. Let's go with the eggs. You pour the eggs here. And I'll be using this spatula 
This is a non-sticky silicone spatula, as I mentioned before. And um, we're going to be letting the eggs So I tilt, I tilt the pan so the eggs can be cooked. Could you please give a zoom here? You tilt the pan to allow the uncooked eggs to flow to the edge of the pan, okay? So... I'll let it cook a little bit more because I don't like... Um, most, most people do not like... Um, um, when the eggs are still like this so we will allow it to cook a little bit more by using this spatula I can lift the edges to check whether it's cooked or not so I'll leave it a little bit longer here. Oops. I like my omelette well cooked. Time for the salt. I almost forgot. So you sprinkle some salt here. Not too much as I mentioned before. This is the Himalayan salt. And I start at the fillings. The onion. The tomato, not too much, just enough, and cheese. Mm, I love cheese. And uh, the heat will melt the cheese. So it will be delicious. And I also like to sprinkle a little bit of oregano. That's enough. Let's check. Let's fold. It's beautiful. So you also fold the omelette with the help of the spatula and um, turn off the heat. And now, could you please give a zoom here? We are going to slide the omelette onto a plate with the help of the spatula. Feeling is getting out, but look. 
and um, I have two types here. And here's a beautiful and um, tasteful omelette. Ta-da! Now, enjoy!